Hi, welcome. In this video, I'm going to go through problem 5. In problem 5, it says, the graph of the function f is shown above. Which of the following statements is false? Okay, so pay attention. We need to know which one is false. A. The limit as x goes to 2 of f of x exists. We look. This is x equals 2. Therefore, the limit as x goes to 2, since um, the left limit and the right limit agree, does in fact exist. Um, we have a, a removable discontinuity there, which means that the limit is x goes to 2 while it exists and is in fact equal to 2, is not equal to the function's value at 2, which is equal to 1. So we have a removable discontinuity at x equals, to, at x equals 2. But removable discontinuities affect continuity requirements, not limit requirements. So the limit does exist. So um, A is not false, therefore not the correct answer. And so we go to B. B concerns uh, the x value 3, but asking the same question. Well, yes, because at x equals 3, the function actually does one better than having a limit. It's continuous. It's not differentiable at x equals 3, uh, because the function has a sharp turning point, which we call a cusp. But it does have a limit, and in fact is continuous, therefore has a limit um, automatically. Okay, all right. And then as x goes to four, uh, the limit of f of x exists. Well, this is clearly false. The limit as x goes to four of our function f appears to be roughly 1.8 if we're approaching 4 from the left, and then the limit is x goes to 4, and this time from the right of our function f is approximately 4. Therefore, the left limit and the right limits right there from the right, right there from the left. Therefore, the left and the right limits at x equals 4 do not agree, um, and therefore the limit doesn't exist. And this is often true at a jump discontinuity, right? Which is what we have at x equals 4, we have a jump discontinuity. So the limit doesn't exist. Okay, and then let's just check D and E. Uh, D says the limit is x goes to five of f of x exists. Uh, yeah, the function is not only continuous, but smooth at x equals five. So according to the visual, it looks differentiable, not just continuous and therefore um, with a limit. Okay, um, and then E says the function f is continuous at x equals three. We already discussed that. It is continuous, it's just not differentiable. So E is not false either, so as we suspected, C is the correct answer. All right, um, take care.